If you looked up to the sky and you saw a bird, a plane, a Superman, perhaps well, it was a meteor. I would worry. In all this time where we've had uh, Hawaii just went, underwent the, the false missile. Uh, Japan, uh, was The it? Japan as well. Uh, the, the alert. Well, this is what happened with the folks in Detroit last night. Take a look at this. Oh. Could you imagine? No. How are they not driving off the road? That is a massive ball of fire coming at you. Yeah, it was a, a meteor. It actually created, a, it had such a sonic boom, it actually created an earthquake oh on the gosh. ground. I thought that they were, doesn't NASA detect this stuff? I thought they're supposed to be able to detect this. The when size. you look at something like that, no, NASA cannot detect meteorites because some of the, that one, like, I don't know. I'm, I'm gonna, I've been told before that one could have been as small as maybe a small pebble. Are you kidding? Most of the ones we see flying across the sky are about the size of a rice crispy or, or a grain of rice. Really? So they can't detect all these little things. It's usually debris from a from a, an asteroid uh, or something like that that we're passing by. And it creates that big of it does. A bright it, light it, it, and, and boom. It goes to show you. So did you watch Gravity? Sidebar. Yes. Did you see the end? Yes. Doesn't you want to make... tell people the end? All right, here we go. I still question what does it mean, because how could she have possibly survived based know. on that news when it? it enters the atmosphere if it creates that much of a boom? 7.55 on breakfast television. Chew on that. We'll be back. All Sandra, I want to do, I is just, she really alive? I just wanted to talk she about She on an you. island? I just wanted to talk about the How did she survive?